Okay. Uh, we want to look at uh, the disk plug. So this implement is called the disk plug. So looking at uh, a disk plug, we want to understand the, the parts of a disk plug, and we also want to look at uh, the advantages of using this. Plow. So in this video, we are going to describe the advantages of using this implement. We are also going to look at the parts of this implement. So to start with the parts of a mod board, uh, of a disc plug. So number one is what I'm holding. This part is called a disc. This part is called a disc. And this function is to provide cutting. It's the one that cuts the switch. This part that you're seeing here, the blue part, is called a main beam, meaning its function is to hold all the parts of the disc plug. Then there's also this part. This part is called a demarcating blade. Others call it they call it, they call it other other names. Others they call it a demarcator, but we call it a demarcating blade. Meaning its function, it gives the direction or it gives the line where you are ending as you are plowing, as you are plowing. Then there is also this part. This part is called uh, a greasing nipple. So a greasing nipple is just a part where greasing is done. When you are greasing the implement, this is the part that is used to, uh, is used for greasing. Meaning, the importance of greasing is to reduce friction when you are plowing and it also protects the implement from tearing and wearing easily. Alright, when you look at this model, this type of a disc plow, it doesn't have what we call the scrappers. But other types of disc plows, you'll find that they have scrappers. So you should have a scrapper here. The function of a scrapper may be to come across a disc plow that has got scrappers. The function is to remove the saws that are attached to the, the disc as it is, as it is plowing. So to repeat the parts, we have the disc, we have the main beam, we have the greasing nipple, and we have a demarcating plate. And lastly, this part is called the um, cross shaft. This part is called the cross shaft, meaning this is the part that is used for connecting an implement to the tractor. So this is where we connect to a lower link, and this part is where we connect to a top link. All right, so having discussed the parts of the disc plow, I want us now to proceed and look at the advantages of 